hello 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 and how are you i'm fine i'm fine um yeah i'm going to show you a quick postnatal way to modify a sun salutation so you can begin to do yoga but not put too much pressure on your core or your pelvic floor um, i think the most important thing with postnatal yoga is to breathe so really focus on those deep calming breaths I like to try and maintain a breath out of around four counts, but don't worry too much about counting it. Just feel like you're controlling the exhale out and really trying to find that calm spot within. Okay, so coming to the top of our mat, ground down through all four corners of your feet. So you might want to lift your toes and then place them back down nice and wide. Lift your inner arches of your feet and feel like drawing up through your thighs and then a slight tuck of your tailbone and just see how that helps you re-engage your core. Shoulder blades down and back and hands to heart. Big breath in, exhale let it go. Inhale, hands float to the sky, forward fold as you breathe out, hands through heart, keep your knees as bent as you need, just let your head hang, feel the blood start to flow down. Halfway lift, nice flat long spine, belly to spine and then ground your hands and walk your feet back into a tabletop position. Hug your belly into your spine and then lift your crown and tail, big arch through your back, breathe in, ground through your back and breathe out, feel everything start to ground down. Inhale, lift everything up, ground as you exhale. Inhale and return to a neutral spine. Drop chest and chin to the mat and then slide your knees back so you're lying on your belly. Wrists stacking under our elbows. Draw your shoulder blades down your back and lift your chest, baby cobra. Exhale, release. One more, inhale, cobra pose. Exhale, release your forehead back down to the mat. Return through tabletop on the inhale. Walk your hands slightly forward, tuck your toes and press your hips back for downward dog. So just bend your knees as much as you need. My knees are super bent here and try and lengthen your spine all the way up. Really ground down through your fingertips and then press back. Maybe start to straighten your legs Leave them a little bit bent if you, that feels comfortable. Feels comfortable for me today. Big breath in. Breath out. One more breath in. Look forward and walk your feet to your hands. Halfway lift, long spine. Draw your belly in towards your spine. Forward fold as you breathe out. Inhale, rise up to Tadasana. Exhale, hands to heart. We'll go through one more time with flow, matching movement to breath. Forward fold as you breathe out. Halfway lift, breath in. Step back into a tabletop position. Inhale, cow pose. Exhale, round through your spine to cat. Breath in, lift your gaze, lift your tail. Breath out as you round everything down. Inhale, look forward. Sink your chest and your chin to the mat. Press back so you're lying on your belly. Forehead to the mat. Inhale, cobra pose. Exhale, release. Inhale, draw belly to spine. Roll shoulder blades down your back. Heart lifts. Exhale, release. Tuck your toes. Press back into tabletop position. Walk your hands slightly forward. Send your hips higher for downward facing dog. Two breaths here. Really connect to your breath. Walk your feet to your hands. Halfway lift. Breath in. Forward fold as you breathe out. Inhale. Rise up to Tadasana. 
hands through heart as you breathe out. Put your hands at your heart and really try and feel that calm, connected energy moving throughout your body. invite you to try and take that this feeling of calm throughout the rest of your day. Thank you so much for practicing with me today. I hope you enjoyed this and I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Thank you beautiful mamas. Namaste.